hey, did you know if you go to ColinMullen.com, you can go and look at art that I've done and maybe even pick up a print if you so desire. It can be put on your wall or on other surfaces. Walls are traditionally where they go, but you could put one there. Go check it out. ColinMullen.com Hey guys, uh, someone asked what my studio setup was, so I'm showing it to you. I'm using my phone to record it because the only other camera I've got is that one there, and it doesn't have a mic, really. Um, hi, Mo. Okay, anyway, uh, real quick though, this is where I keep all my canvases that I've worked on and stuff like that. Just in, there's not enough wall space in this apartment in order to do all that. We've also got a couple more that I keep up on the wall here, just because I like them. Got where I keep most of my canvases before I work on them, and my cat. Hi! Alright. And um, this is where I do like everything. It's cleaner than normal because Tilda cleaned it for me, which was nice. Um, normally there's like a thousand more things, most of which are post-it notes. I think she stacked all the ones that she found there. Um, it's the only way I can remember things. We got a couple albums and some skeletons. This one I got from Dick Flick. It's, it's okay, I don't like the skull as much. It's a little wonky. I got these skulls that I got from like Halloween stores. They're great for just references. Those wooden mannequin things that everyone and their brother has because that's a thing you give people for Christmas, I guess. Uh, a wood uh, block that I was working on. For the, I had like a printmaking class in college and I really liked that one. It's kind of the only thing I have left of it. I gave the rest of the, uh, I gave a majority of the pr prints to the band of uh, Papa Emeritus from Ghost BC. Saw them uh, once live in like a meet and greet and so I handed off some of the prints. Papa Emeritus, I think it was three at that time. He, he was cool about it. Um, but yeah, a couple of signed stuff, some signed things. Uh, we've got my painter's palette. I usually just use like a paper one because the, I don't know, I don't, I don't like the wood ones or the plastic ones because you can't clean them well enough in my opinion. Uh, this is where I normally set up to stream. Got my little boom mic that I can bring down. Uh, just kind of bring it right in front of the keyboard there and just talk directly into it. Got this uh, poster I made for uh, a band I was working on. Put some post-it notes so you can't read my phone number. Kind of, eh, it, it turned out okay. I mean, the band was fun, but we never really actually like played a show or anything, so that was too bad. Um, the DSLR that I use to record the paintings. Uh, I've got little markers on the floor, because like I said, this is sort of like a hallway, more so than anything else. So in order to get to the kitchen, we kind of have to have this move out of the way most of the time. But for now it's set up, because I'm about to record some of that. Uh, usually I try and keep my canvases set up and ready to go, so I can just paint whenever. But I do have little markers there as well, same sort of reason just in case if they get in the way. This one I'm gonna do a video on, haven't gotten around to posting, unless if I did already. I don't know what order these videos are coming out. Uh, and then this little toolbox I got from a hardware supply store where I keep all my painting stuff. Uh, no real organization to it, just it's in there. Use kind of cheapo Liquitex uh, basic paint just because it covers well enough and it looks good enough to me. Um, but yeah, that's a majority of it. That's kind of what I, I deal with. There's the actual PC I use. It's my old one. Uh, I used to stream with that, but then it started to kind of die on me, so uh, I replaced it, which is unfortunate, but it is the way the way the world works. But yeah, um, I see this stuff like every day, so there's probably stuff here that you want to ask questions about, maybe or you just find this video boring. Uh, fortunately, I probably only do like one studio tour uh, every few years, just because I don't plan on moving from here for a while. But yeah, that's uh, that's basically my setup for streaming and painting and everything. Uh, so yeah, anytime you see me streaming, there's probably that canvas set up too. But yeah, if you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, um, hope you enjoyed the video. Just got a rundown of the absolute mess of a human being that I am and how I uh, set up my workspace. But yeah, anyway, thank you for watching. Bye!